this is the pink smoke palette which is $18.99 as you can see and this does come with nine shades this packaging is pretty sturdy and in my opinion i really think it's worth the money i know the packaging like isn't all that fancy and i'm not just saying i like it because i have an affiliate code with them i just really like it because the matte shadows work great in this palette and they blend out really really nicely the pressed glitter shadows are a little bit harder to work with i think if i would have tried it with the glitter primer it would have stuck better but i couldn't find my glitter primer so i used concealer for now but here are the shades swatched on my arm as as you can see the glitters are a little bit more patchier i noticed they work better if you grab some and just pat it on instead of swiping then this is a clear lip gloss plumper for 11.99 I did zoom in a little bit more so you can see the logo. They didn't change it or anything, but it's not a sticker anymore. So as you can see, now it's not really a sticker anymore. If that was a deal breaker for you, it's kind of more engraved, I guess, a little bit now. And the top holder piece is a little bit square, and there is a stopper in there, as you can see. And that is the lip applicator, and there's the stopper. So I was just trying to show you guys, and there's a swatch of the clear lip plumping gloss. Next is the clear glitter gloss for $9.49 and as you can see it's a round component with the boxwood sticker. I bought this one a while ago so like I said it, they did used to be stickers and now they're that first one I showed you but here's the lip applicator and the stopper and then here's a swatch of it. Next, these ones are my favorite. They're $10.49 each. These ones are just lip toppers, but with like little things in them, as you can see. I like these because they're moisturizing and they're very glossy once you put them on. So I like to use these when I'm done. Skincare or I'm just finishing my makeup. I put this on before I put my lip scrub and my lip product on. Next is the Peach OG and I got this for $11 and as you can see it's the round component and it doesn't have the sticker on the bottom. This one I believe was supposed to have some CBD in it which is why I wanted to try it. This one did make my lips smooth but be careful if you're sensitive to scents because it does kind of have a strong smell. I'm not sure what happened to the stopper on the inside but I did notice when I opened the lid up again it was there so I'm not too sure what happened but here's me putting on the makeup. First, I'm starting with the shade Fire OG, and I'm putting that at the top of my lid. I'm just putting that above my crease, and now I'm doing the other eye with the Fire OG shade. Next, I'm taking Banana OG and I'm just blending that out really nicely with that orange shade. I want it to look like a sunset. Now I'm just going to go ahead and do the other eye and just blend it out really, really nicely. Then my camera cut out, but I took a small blending brush and I used Pinky OG Grape Ape and Wedding Cake. Then I blended those two in the crease and blended out with the orange and yellow shade. After that, I cut my crease with concealer and I used Star Kush on the top of my lid. Next, I'm doing the bottom lid and I'm taking wedding cake and just blending that out. Then I'm taking banana OG and I'm just kind of blending it out to the bottom. Then some of Pink OG because it's a little bit darker than the Wedding Cake shade. So I was trying to give it a bold look on the bottom. So that's why I'm taking Pink OG. Then 
then in my inner corner i'm taking sugar tits and again i think this would have stuck a lot better if i would have used a glitter primer but i just wanted to see how it would work and it did kind of transfer on the top of my lid so like i said it probably would work better glitter primer but now i'm just gonna take the excess powder and wipe it off next these are the 25 millimeter lashes and the style act up i'm taking some of the peach og gloss and putting it on my lips then for a little extra shine i'm taking that lip plumper gloss and just putting it right on top that's all for this video make sure you give it a thumbs up it makes me super happy when you guys do make sure you subscribe to my channel and ring the bell so you never miss when i upload bye like bobby and whitney ah. say i'm the goat act like i don't know but fuck it i'm obviously winning don't